would like to ask Genevieve, our next speaker, to get up and share her thoughts. Young Leaders Against Sexual Violence is a collective of us. 11 people who come from incredibly different and diverse backgrounds who share one common goal, to eliminate sexual violence in all of its forms around the world. Over the next two years, we will work together to be a loud voice in this sphere and develop an education solution to sexual and gender-based violence. Hi, I'm Genevieve Westro and I'm the Managing Director of The Unmentionables. And I'm also a person of many passions. The first is education, because of a moment in my childhood where I saw what it looked like to not go to school. The second is sexual violence, because after my second assault, I got really, really angry. Angry because I was not alone, and that there were, had been millions of survivors before me, and there would be millions after if nothing was done. So I combined my two passions. I now work with forcibly displaced people who so often are denied an access to education and provide sexual and reproductive health access, support, and protection to men and women. In my work, I've discovered that sexual violence disproportionately affects refugees, migrants, and asylum seekers because of their vulnerability in citizenship and, um, wow, sorry guys, um, and because of the risk that's associated with fleeing violence. This is not okay. Sexual health and sexual violence are intrinsically linked. Without access to sexual and reproductive health education, People are not able to make the most fundamental human decisions over their bodies and choose to fight if those have been violated. There are 68.5 million displaced people around the world. That's twice the size of my home country, Canada. I recognize that this number is only going to increase with the amount of conflict we see today, but I refuse to accept that that amount of sexual assault needs to go up too. I vow to turn my passion and anger into a solution, and I promise that education is the answer. Thank you. 